What are your plans over the Christmas New Year break? Um, I know for myself, I'll be taking some time to recharge. It's been quite a long year, lots of meetings, uh, fairly hectic. I'm pretty tired as you come to the final weeks of the year. And so I'm going to spend a bit of time uh, certainly just recalibrating, recharging. But I do want to uh, spend some time with some uh, key activities over this period. And I am taking a little bit of a break. So obviously we've got Christmas New Year, but I'll take a couple of weeks off in January. And, you know, I like to have a bit of a game plan for that time. So uh, my routine is kind of being designed as to what I'm going to do each day uh, so they get the most out of the time and um, you know for me personally I want to get on top of some personal reading um, I've got a whole pile of books I never got around to read during the year and um, I want to do some of my hobbies um, I love photography so I want to spend a bit of time getting out and about and I'm going to do a lot of walking um, I live in Sanctuary Cove and so the plan is to sort of get up really early uh, do a nice long walk go and have a swim in the intercontinental intercontinental uh, lagoon um, and you know really have a beautiful sort of way of spending my mornings because I won't be coaching um, so think about what you're planning to do obviously it can be quite a hectic time with family and friends and trying to catch up with everybody but it's also a perfect time to reset the habits for the year ahead reset your morning routine get things into a better rhythm if you found yourself out of balance in 2023 maybe this is the time to reset Set. I know myself, you know, despite all of my knowledge how important it is, I've slipped out of the habit of walking regularly. And so I've really got to get back into that habit. I've got to force myself to get up maybe a bit earlier, um, you know, sort of get my walk done before I walk the dogs. If anyone has dogs, you'll know a walk with a dog is not a walk. Uh, you're stopping frequently and, and everyone has to sniff everything. So you're not getting any physical exercise. And so I've really got to build that routine back into my you know my systems and so you know you think about your routine for the year ahead how you want to optimize your performance and you know you could be using some of this time to get those things in check also use it as a good time to get all your health checks done uh, everything else you know in order so that you can hit the ground running uh, in 2024 and of course you know it's a perfect time to do all that planning for the year ahead but get some down time get uh, recharged I know it's been a really challenging year for a lot of people and I know Christmas is not always the best of times for for a number of people for a number of reasons uh, so you know just be kind to yourself you know you know get yourself into a good self-care routine and um, just you know really enjoy the the break it's uh, uh, you know been sort of challenging times a time of self-reflection uh, but it is often a time also to come together with some family and some friends uh, and catch up on uh, a lot of things that maybe we, we, we ignored during the course of the year. So uh, perfect time to get those things, uh, get your house in order for the year ahead. So you're highly productive as a business executive and you've got that perfect balance of work-life balance.